Good news tonight. After 14 months of mask wearing, you'll finally be able to take them off soon. Good evening. I'm Mike Montecalvo. And I'm Shannon Heggie. Mask mandates are being lifted in Rhode Island tomorrow and on May 29th in Massachusetts. However, businesses will be able to use their own discretion. 12 News reporter Rob Nesbitt joins us in studio with how two local business owners are handling the mask changes. Rob? Shannon, you'll want to check the front doors of businesses to know if you should put on a mask before going inside. Most owners will be given the choice of what's best for their customers. No, they'll come down. They'll come down tomorrow. The mask signs on the front door of Rude Awakenings will be a thing of the past. Owner David Levesque says his five locations will be doing what the CDC allows. We're going to follow those guidelines. We're not requiring anybody to wear a mask. Uh, we've already notified our team. Fully vaccinated people will no longer have to wear a mask inside most places in Rhode Island, but Levesque says he doesn't plan on checking customers for proof of a vaccination card. But we're not going to police it with the people. We're going to let people come in and be as free as they should be based on their rights. Governor McKee says that the mask update isn't a free pass, but more of an incentive for Rhode Islanders to get the vaccine. It's a wake up call for everybody that is, has been unvaccinated to actually take care of the opportunities. There's plenty of supply, and we're making it very convenient for people to get vaccinated. Not every business owner is doing away with face coverings. We're going to still have our customers wear masks when they come in. Owner of Homestyle in Providence, Lisa Paratori, says the state has not been clear enough about rules for retail stores. She believes vaccines are effective, but is going to wait before allowing customers the right to take masks off inside Homestyle. It's about making sure that we as business owners within the state are following the rules that apply to us. McKee is expected to provide further clarification to businesses later this week. Capacity limits on businesses will be lifted in Rhode Island on Friday, although three feet spacing will still be required indoors. Reporting live in studio, I'm Rob Nesbitt, 12 News.